Hi, I'm John Urban of Mustangs TV. On this edition Between the Pipes, Kelly Campbell of your Western Mustangs women's hockey team. First of all, Kelly, thank you very much for your time. Thank you for having me. Now, Kelly, thinking back back in the day, do you remember the first time you ever put on the pads? I don't remember it, but I remember being told it. I was uh, two years old in the basement, and my brother needed something to shoot at. So I volunteered and threw on the goal pads, so two years old. Now, after stonewalling your brother a couple times in the basement, did you start to get a love for the position? You know, I didn't right off the bat. I liked it in road hockey, but um, I started out as a forward, and then when I was, I think, about 10, I switched and became a goalie. Well, at that point, though, when did the love start to grow? Uh, as soon as I threw on the pads on the ice, I absolutely fell in love with it. It's kind of funny. My parents, uh, they sent me to the boys' league because they were hoping that I would get so many shots and absolutely hate it that I would never want to do it again, and it kind of backfired on them. Let's talk actually about that. I heard a rumor that Chris Higgins, the head coach of the team, actually got a call to come check out this young girl that was actually stonewalling all the guys in a beer link rink. Is there any truth to that? And when was the first time you actually ever introduced yourself to Chris? Yeah, I mean, uh, as soon as I knew I was coming to Western, I was like, you know what? I'm going to play hockey again. So uh, I was literally playing beer league at Brookside. And uh, yeah, I emailed Chris and he came by and watched a few games and said, yeah, we'll take you. Going back to when you were growing up as a kid, you know, in the basement, taking pucks from your brother, was there a goalie that you started to emulate or, you know, see your styles kind of comparable as you started to, you know, enjoy the sport once you got on the ice? I don't know if I was any comparison to him, but um, I was, uh, Curtis Joseph was the guy who I looked up to, so I still have a picture in my room with him. I haven't seen you gone after any referees yet, though, like him. <laughs> no. <laughs> Now that you're a Western Mustang, and let's face it, Kelly, you're one of the pinnacle of success as far as goaltenders in the OUA women's division of hockey. Um, is there any added pressure coming into this season, knowing that, I mean, you're a CIS All-Canadian goaltender. You also won gold for Team Canada at FISU. The one thing that this team just hasn't done under your belt yet is gone past the OUA championship. Yeah, I mean, it's uh, there's always a little bit of pressure, but... Once you step in the room and step on the ice, that all goes away. You know, the girls are great, we have a great team, and I think this is the year. What's the sisterhood like in that locker room? Because clearly it's evident you guys haven't lost a game in regulation. Oh gosh, no. Uh, we love each other. I mean, it's literally a family, you know. Someone's having a bad day, we'll pick them up, and someone's having a great day, we'll knock them down a little bit. But uh, no, it's, it's literally one big family. One thing that people might not know about Kelly Campbell is that you're just as good on a plane as you are between the pipes. Uh, how did you get into wanting to become a pilot and then be high in the sky? Yeah, um, you know, I have no idea how I initially got into it. No, I'm just kidding. Um, when I was 13 years old, um, there we were having free flights in, at the St. Thomas Airport for, uh, for kids. So, you know, my dad and I had nothing to do that day. So we decided to go out. I got to go up for a flight uh, for free, and uh, I liked it. I didn't, I wouldn't say I loved it initially. I was like, you have to be a rocket scientist and a millionaire to be a pilot. So I kind of pushed it off to the side. And then uh, when I was 16, trying to figure out my career, I was like, you know what? I can do this. So uh, I enrolled when I was 16 and started flying, and I soloed before I could drive a car on my own, which was a little bit weird. <laughs> Now, most people, let's face facts, Kelly, when they leave Western, they've sort of made that transition in their life from whatever varsity sport that they were competing in into whatever, obviously, education that they were pursuing at the university. With you, though, it's clear with some other players as well that you have options leaving Western. Is that going to be a tough time, though, for yourself, deciding whether you're going to head to the skies in a plane or whether you're going to stay in a blue paint on the ice? Oh, 100%. That's going to be the hardest decision of my life, you know. I want to keep playing hockey as long as I can, obviously. As long as I'm still one of the top goalies around, I'm going to try and keep playing. So we'll see what happens in the future. Kelly Campbell, Between the Pipes, here on Mustangs TV.